There we go. Oh, hi everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian tonight, along with... Thank you so much, Lieutenant Drakir, at your service. And why am I burping when I'm not even eating or drinking anything yet? <laughs> and welcome to a new game we'll be streaming, Nefarious. And just from the music and the... <laughs> I get the feeling this is going to be quite a ride. Plus, there's also the fact that we showcased this game, like, last year. <laughs> uh. we, we, we haven't even reached only one year anniversary when we uh, showcased this. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, let's get started then. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Erase that, so we can start fresh. And let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this game is just absolutely leaking with charm. Stop me if you've heard this one before. Bad guy crashes party, kidnaps princess, makes dramatic exit. Plucky handsome hero gives chase. Epic quest ensues. But funny story. Yeah, I'm the bad guy. <laughs> Crow. The curse of my name will be caked on the walls of those who serve justice. Crow. <laughs> okay, I'm using a controller this time. Is that all really necessary? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Jumping, not just for heroes. Okay, he's waiting to strike. <laughs> Okay, let me do a little double check. Okay, uh, I didn't see an option for subtitles. So hopefully there isn't too much that really Dodo Grill simulated extinct meats. Oh dear. And also, I think pretty much everything is subtitled for that's the only way you hear them talk. Well, not in the first bit there, but let's hope that doesn't happen too often. Yep. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, this game has a big uh, way forward feel, uh huh? Yeah, and. <laughs> it, it, I don't know if it's but I think it's not. It's maybe kind of on today's standard. So, again, I think I watched it before, just when I met you on Git Wars. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's move animation. <laughs> and, uh,. Recognize this car here? It's missing two of its wheels. Um, I need a clue. <laughs> that looks a lot like Lady Penelope's car from Thunderbirds. Okay, those. Be <laughs> yes. I was probably five or four when I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> So how do you expect me to remember that? Locked? Fuck, he's over chumps. <laughs> Just break it and start punch out to open this puppy up. <laughs> oh no, heal! What? He said fa. <laughs> you said fuck. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Just like he will take an early retirement. Just like this guy. There. Ow. Okay. I'm getting a big uh, 1950s, 60s vibe from the music at the moment. <laughs> but yeah, this is the tutorial after all. Yep. Yo, you're... Okay, so if we're standing directly on top of an enemy, we don't take damage, but we can't actually hit them either. Okay, nice little detail. Because contact damage can be such an utter pain in the ass. Okay. Oh, I almost have got. <laughs> hey, what's where you're stepping, you owe? Yeesh, my bad. <laughs> you were saying? This game has multiple endings. Okay, I didn't know that. That could How be fun to find out. I forgot how many. I think it's two or three. A 
adopt a pod? Pick up your eight-legged friend today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to see what the <clears throat> the conditions for that are. And if they're not too much, we can try for multiple of the endings. Okay, these guys do have contact damage. Two of them are easy, that I remember. That's in the finale, but if, if you choose to be a... Uh, yeah, don't spoil it too and much. Basically, you have your two choices there. I would say that. I'll, I'll okay, and then there's a third yeah. one to take. Yeah, the, the problem is, I don't think I would put it, but if there is a third one, and what the requirement the third one would be. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Wanted alias Crow. Okay, so that's our guy without the armor on. Do wonder what's over there. But we're not resistant to electricity, so let's not go risk it. I'm presuming we might come back to the game at some point. We might get electricity immunity at some point or something. Boss, we've held the other perimeter as you requested. And we set up your death rate just up ahead. <laughs> Time to start this assault in earnest. <laughs> okay. Hmm. So I need to dump. I forget who the developers of this game actually are. Oh, hello. This is the MCPD. Put the princess down or we will open fire. You do know she's not bulletproof, right? <laughs> Okay, it progresses on its own if you wait a little bit. There it is. Ooh, bit it low on health. Oop. Oop, but so are they. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Boss, that was awesome. <laughs> hey, Tyrone, how's the family? Hey, Miss Mayapple. They're great, thanks for asking. <laughs> Back it off, stop being nice to my minions. <laughs> Henceforth, we have Becky is in my care package. It's time to blow stuff up. Actually, I might need to check if this is actually a way forward game. <laughs> it can happen here. Watch for grenades. Okay, uh, yeah. I like that they give the tutorials in the billboards like that. Ah, right on time. My old rival, Mac. Mac, my hero. Crow, May Apple. Don't you have some heroic banter you'd like to pass my way? Just get it, you know, go get in your giant eyeball laser or whatever it is. And I can kick your butt and we can get on with this. I need to talk to May Apple. Okay, someone just doesn't care anymore. Let's see. Um. Okay, we're immune, we're immune to our own grenades. It just bounced. Come on, how hard is this? <laughs> oh, I'll just plant it right freaking next to it. <laughs> then the grenades bounce each other away? Okay. Oh, oh, I see. I completely overlooked the big freaking button. I overlooked the sideboard as well. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You have so much life and animation in this. <laughs> and I forgot that the boss actually either is or uh, the fairy is too or not at the moment. We'll have to see. I'll take that. This well hotel. And the music's gone. And okay. You see in the background? Yep, that's the carrier. And our grenades refill over time. Nice to know. That again. 
Okay, here we go. Finally, my knight in shining armor, my hero, my love. May Apple, I'm breaking up with you. What? No, you're doing this right now. Face. <laughs> Hello, super villain, right here. We barely see each other anymore. You spend more time with Crow than me. Because he kidnaps me. And now you're defending him. You two are inseparable. <laughs> that face, guys. <laughs> McIntyre Donald Mulder, you get up here and rescue your princess this instant. <laughs> I don't have time for this anymore. I have real crimes to stop. <laughs> hey, I am committing a real crime here. A nerve. I've never been so insulted. I know, right? <laughs> well, this is awkward. I had victory music planned and everything for the day I finally defeated Mac. Let's just go. Yeah, okay. Can I still play the music? Sure, whatever. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Hold on. I just realized over here. What? Flying airship. Purple. Beardless. Losses. Yes. Go for something to go first, Captain. No. Are you sure? <laughs> and yeah. The game is made by Starblade, not way forward. So I wouldn't be surprised if they're inspired. He just gave up. Uh, I might be a villain, but he's the real jerk here. Becky. Boss, Princess Mayapple, may I have the men prepare your sweets? Hey, Bex. No, I think I'll go gaze off the, you know, off the deck wistfully for a while. I have some steam I need to blow off. Very well. I shall have the means to prepare your usual spell to risotto and a nice side of soup up presto. <laughs> it's as though I don't command fear anymore. He just flew away. Boss, I may be, yeah, yeah. I believe you may be able to utilize this as an opportunity. Of course, I know that. I wanted to win, but not like this. Perhaps you can clue me in on what exactly the plan is? We never seem to keep Mayapple long enough to move on to step two. <laughs> Kidnapping the princess is a time-honored villain tradition. I've been putting together plans for a royalty-powered death ray, and... I... Ugh, this doesn't feel right. Evil ski monologues should be di direct <laughs> dictated to heroes before I destroy them. I would think, as your major domo, it is prudent to keep me in the loop. Here's all you need to know. I am a genius, and we need five princesses. Once that is complete, I can rule the world and reshape it as I see fit. Very well. They must now travel abroad to the other kingdoms. The Syndicate of Malice will not look favorably, yeah, favorably if we start kidnapping the designated princes of other villains. But I am certain I can find a, uh, a loophole to bypass protocol laws. Next step is Princess Apodia from the Insectia Kingdom. When you are ready to proceed, go up the elevator to the bridge and take the wheel. I also just gotta love the fact that the villains have their own laws. Despite being, well, villains. Well, it does make sense. Like, you have heard, like, on among thieves and all that. Yeah, but typically and there's not supposed to be any. 
here, and don't, let's not forget Mafia. Yeah. Who said all that? <laughs> Linden Mayer. Thanks for the job, boss. Just imagine, if you hadn't hired me, I would have been stuck in here in the farm line, the family lime farm. What a relief, right? <laughs> uh, okay, Andy. They said I get my own pony. I like ponies. <laughs> but yeah, with this game, I'm giving heavy f vibes from Way Forwards and Mega Mind of all things. <laughs> I was. But I see this. I feel like uh, someone could this region from uh, Super Mario and Mega Man and other g games like those. Yeah, because Mac was very obviously supposed to be like Mega Man. Yeah. Uh, let's talk. Stable. I hope you're well, boss. Down here, I only have the minions and the giant robot to keep me company. Not to keep my company. I swore one uh, day I saw some of them wink at me the other day. Yep, they, I swore I saw one of them wink at me the other day. How did I get it mixed up? Yeah. Which one? Does it really matter? It's creepy either way. Okay, so here we can get upgrades. Let's see. Grenades, classic nades, versatile and powerful, three second fuse, bounce off walls, uh, subject to gravity. What okay. the heck? Hmm? Look at his knees. Uh, what are those? Did he, does he have cybernetic legs or something? But actually, yes, I think he does. And one of yeah, his arms is just plain ass. Half gone. Yeah, and it looks like he has done something with his kneecaps. Yeah, those are not. Uh, they're hard over. Yeah. Like, yeah hmm. I, I don't have a bone where the knee is, but I don't think it looks like that. Yeah, I, I think his legs might be cybernetic, same as his left arm. Huh. Okay. Like that left arm is very obviously metal. Let's see... Okay, looks like we'll be able to equip one of these and two of these. Once we unlock them, and I'm guessing... Yeah, these are just plain upgrades here. We don't have enough to get any of them. Okay. So we'll need more cash for all of that. Halo Blast. Any huge explosion scheduled for the day, boss? <laughs> Actually, let's also check this way. Just to have a look. Hello? There's a record down there. Yep. Hmm. Even more, folks. Albert Frost. Hey, boss, have you ever considered writing a book about all your adventures? Oh, uh, I know who these are. What? Do you remember, like, how many skills you made me think are people who I think either beta tested this game or have to be kickstarting it? Yeah, probably. Kickstarters. <laughs> Ira, no needs. Meatloaf today in the cafeteria. Again. Not that I'm complaining or anything, sir. I think you pretty clearly are. Screaming weasel. If I keep telling myself another day in paradise, eventually I'll start to believe it. <laughs> uh, uh, wait, uh... Ah, there, Axon. Hey, boss. I don't think I can take another one of these princess and another castle jokes the guys keep fighting. <laughs> Permission to bust a cap? No. <laughs> also, can we...? Mm, no, sadly, no karaoke. Thank goodness, no karaoke. You'll be glad to know. I have issued a new memo to the minions. They are no longer allowed to have meetings next to explosive red barrels. <laughs> what did I think of that? <laughs> Hindsight is 2020. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, they, they kept getting blown up. 
Yeah, 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 use 2020? I'm not familiar with that term. Uh, if I remember correctly, with, when measuring eyesight, it's typically that 20 is supposed to be the, uh, the baseline. So if you have oh. eyesight of 19, 20 or 21, 20, then uh, one of your eyes is not as... Uh, uh, it, you're either a tiny bit far-sighted or a tiny bit near-sighted. Though just one or two difference is not much of a thing. I think if you get to 15 or 10 and such, then is when you start having trouble. Oh. I can't believe he broke up with me. I can't believe he didn't, didn't even try to work me. I can just imagine the Town Lord headlines. Princess faces despair on death ray. <laughs> Mac Apple has turned sour. <laughs> That's actually better. <laughs> Missed my true calling. <laughs> okay, this game is just going to be absolutely hilarious to get through. Also, I see hilarious and heartwarming. Ah, come on, you're not going to let me jump off my own ship. Captain, it's perfectly serious if we would allow you to jump off your own ship. <laughs> also, where the hell was that bicycle noise coming from? <laughs> Anyways, we have more <laughs> of the ship to look at. I wonder what it's supposed to mean. <laughs> Mate, was, was that the sound of the elevator or something? But how did... We, yeah, I'm, uh, we'll see about that. <laughs> Okay, so we get ranked on finding three crowns in records and just time and respawns. Not going to go for any personal bests or something, I'm just going to go through and see what we can get. Okay. We're stepping out of our comfort zones here, boss. But I've received inter reports about the Princess uh, Opedia. Opedia, yeah. She rules in Sextia with an iron thorax. Or iron mandible, whatever it is that insects rule with. What's a thorax? Isn't that the butt? Sure. Get in, kidnap the princess, and then get out. <laughs> okay. I, I do also love just how fluid everything moves. Oh, if you want to take your time, that's okay. I'm not. I'm paid by the hour. <laughs> Wait, you need to talk to the. Yep. Hmm? Well Wait, done, Captain. You make every pirate proud. You miss every single coin. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the real price is going to be the princess, so a few coins can be missed. <laughs> yeah, I really, uh, yeah, I would recommend you to talk to the characters before you go down to missions. Okay. Again. Don't worry about all that. <laughs> so this, pla this place is just a French beehive, from the sounds of it. With oh, the music and such. Christ! And what uh, this is uh, a reference to. <laughs> okay. Buzz off. <laughs> well. Okay, I completely missed what the hell that enemy was. Okay, we've got a few shooters. Oop. Get lost, you. Okay. No. It, oh, that's blocked off by shields. Okay. Can I stand? No, I cannot stand on them. We can punch they won't them. stand for that. In the face. <laughs> okay. Right. Hmm? Oh, yeah. no, do you hear the music? 
<laughs> yeah, buzzing. Bzz, bzz, bzz. <laughs> okay, that does sound like a fart. <laughs> Is there something over here? Nope. But I can't get rid of you. Okay. Wait. There. Anything? Nope. Okay, I'll take that trait. Hello? And there's the records. You've added Thorax Waltz to your Duke's box. Okay. Uh, neat. <laughs> the jury is still out on what exactly a Thorax is. <laughs> okay. You know? Uh, not a. Hmm, I've heard it mentioned decently often in. But I forget exactly what... I think it's supposed to be the middle or something. The, between I what, the... Uh, and, hmm? I know what it is, and they will tell you later. Okay. There you go. But yeah, I wanted to check. Okay. Stand by, sending a squad of minions to override their control center. Oh dear. <laughs> And just a lot of honey. Honey, I'm home with the honey. <laughs> well, I, I've been trying. I've been trying to. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> I've been You're trying to use honey more in sauces and such. Nobody keeps this bird in the cage. You were going to say? They have tried only in some a team once or twice, maybe with hesitation. I'm sure honey I'm mustard sure and all that. Okay, oh, we, wait. we can't hurt the mustard road up. Makes sense. Okay, I think I tried something else that is like, like a fake honey or something. As opposed to be, quote unquote, healthier. Okay, sub substitute honey. Yeah, and I thought it was alright. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? You're not my usual kidnapper, we're a Scorpio. He uh, caught in sick, felt cold. I highly doubt that. Scorpio er, is a robot. Really? Because I was totally picturing a giant scorpion. Yeah, he gets that a lot. <laughs> there we go. And, okay, she, see, she's constantly flapping our wings, she's giving us a higher jump. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, I've been making a sort of improvised honey mustard sauce a few times recently, like, uh, uh... That's just plain gone. Like, three parts, uh... Three parts uh, mayonnaise, one part mustard, and then some honey to mix in for the taste. Okay, I need to get a health. Ow. <laughs> okay, just as I was about to get some health again. Okay. Yeah, what was it? Those little books you see there? I think they were inspired by Dark Souls? Could be. Uh, but there's a bunch of you. Lucky Love is the only thing they borrowed from Dark Souls. Oh, okay, those will vanish after a time. Okay. 
So we can also get, yep, we can get rid of those by getting behind their shields. There. Okay. Say, Princess, what's a thorax? Excuse me? And a bug. Is the thorax the butt? <laughs> Can we keep this kid living on a professional level, please? <laughs> He's sorry I asked. Uh, hello, big bug. Uh, you mean dragon Bye fly? <laughs> More like a dragon-sized fly. Okay, I should use the grenades more often, since they're a lot safer to use. Gimme. And yeah, we have at least enough for one of the health upgrades. Maybe we can even find enough to for the second. Don't you remember? But if we actually meet the other villains or not, that would be pretty funny. I know you may meet other heroes, but the villain? Uh, question mark. <laughs> bye bye. He still got hit by a grenade. A combust delicious. Defeat 50 enemies with grenades. <laughs> Ooh, those fall. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. Thank you. Ooh. Nope, those are not going high enough. Okay. It's, it seems like the grenades... You have a bit what? of a different speed sometimes, or is it more that I... Hmm. Oh, sure. Uh, those two went a... out at different speeds. Is it maybe to avoid spamming? I think it might oh, be. <laughs> I don't know it's all these classical punch sounds come from? Probably just absolutely ancient stock recordings. Yeah, but still, like, let's be honest, if you actually punch someone, that's not the sound you will hear. Yeah. <laughs> so if I punch you, you I would probably hear a ow or something. Boss, we tried holding down the pallets in your instead, but Dash is hot on your heels. Becky, sound down my death pod. It's on the way, sir. Extraction point locked in. Ascend the summit of this tower to run the room. Okay. I, I said, you ever finished this game before? Nope. So this one is completely fresh for me. Not so much for you, but that'll yeah. make it all the more fun. Yeah, dude, it was a lot of years ago I watched this. Uh, a lot of things I probably wouldn't remember when I see hey. it and you missed the crown. That's why I'm trying to go back. God oh, damn it. Okay, this way then. <laughs> no more Mr. Nice Crow. Okay. Wait. Okay, that, that, did, that, that did sound like a fart in the music. Oh, no, I just realized, if you put an end at the end of crow, it becomes crown. Yep. Okay. Yo, that's quite the weather we're having today. It... <laughs> Not so fast. Guys, you've come to rescue me. Evil is afoot in the kingdom of Esectia, and that's no good. Prepare to be knocked off your soapbox, little nose. Do you <laughs> recognize the icon? <laughs> I recognize a lot of this to be very uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. So incoming. Well done. <laughs> so, right? th this is a this is an absolutely classic. This is an absolutely classic uh, of design of Eggman's. 
Yep. Also, Needle Nose is. Was that one of Sonic's uh, beta names or something like that? Yeah, I know his name was a Needle Mouse or something. Was uh, was it Project Me Needle Mouse or something like that? Needle Pack would probably make more sense than Needle Nose, mm. as you know, Hedgehog. Yeah, Bonk. And yeah, people, get ready to the you are the boss. Yep. You could say the big bad boss. Yeah, if you only knew how much I resisted to go from full orc there. <laughs> Kick your butt, check. Kidnap the princess, double check. <laughs> Buzz, Buzz off. off. Without taking any damage, okay. <laughs> Did you read that out loud at the same time? About. <laughs> but yeah, I suspect all the boss fights are going to be uh, big references to other... <laughs> into other series. Yes. <laughs> okay. Welcome back, boss. I see the plan is coming, going smoothly. What a dreadful dread fort. Is this where I am to be launched? <laughs> You're in good company. May Apple can show you around the facilities. Hmm. I've been doing some research on what you said before, boss. Everyone knows there is some magical force surrounding princesses. That's right, everyone. Something ancient, powerful. You're planning on harnessing that power to rule the world. To power a doomsday device. Doom howitzer. That is ruthless. I have to say, boss, I am a little impressed. <laughs> what a delightfully evil plan. We must now continue our campaign then to the, e no, to the east. The, the dwarven kingdom of Winterdown. The Ogre Kingdom of Sukochi. They have been co in conflict for years. We'll have to take advantage of this chaos. Doesn't matter which one we do first. Either way, we have to get them both. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, mm. no, as I said, a lot of recording comes from talking with the NBCs. And it's probably good to talk with the princess and all that. Currently and before the missions. Yeah. Okay, let's get some upgrades. So, what is it? I don't know if that has effect on the extra ending, if there is one. Uh, okay, we can unlock these. <clears throat> I missed uh, that we could buy these early. I thought these would unlock over time or something. Uh, let's see. First off, though, health upgrade. Yeah, calcium. Good for your bones. Human need. <laughs> humans need those, right? Increase your health by two. And then armor plating because you can't really ever have enough of that to give two more health. What is this? A treadmill? I guess it'll help your endurance. <laughs> and we have ammo upgrade. Micro converters in your suit speed up grenade fabrication time and one to your maximum ammo. High quality transistors and nanobots build you, even, uh, build you more grenades faster and you don't even have to give them a pay raise. <laughs> we'll swap out your suit's internal battery with antimatter. Yes, it's perfectly safe. Probably. <laughs> okay, so over here we have our basic grenade, then we have. Gyrock, uh, Gyrick, or Gyrock missiles, or missiles, self-propelled missiles that explode on contact. Grenade jumping is impossible. Okay, so now we know that grenade jumping is a thing that we can actually do. Sticky grenades, sticks to surfaces, explodes on enemies. Don't eat one, however good it might look. And assault fire. Ditch the grenades and fire off a storm of bullets instead. <laughs> Grenade jumping is impossible. Okay, then we have the charging punch. Hold down the punch button for a short time, then release to give your punch some more oomph. Explosive punch. Adds an explosive charge at the apex of your punch. 
rocket punch for when you want to punch something, but it's way over there. And multi punch, triple the punch, triple the fun. I just realized you can have two punches. Yep, so we could have an explosive uh, charge punch, an explosive rocket punch, or an explosive triple punch, or just send three fists out. Oh dear, and not enough, damn it. If you hadn't managed all those coins so horribly, it's part of the last one. <laughs> I don't think it would have made that much of a difference. Okay. Okay, seems like the mains are mostly saying the same thing. Yeah, they, they will change later, I think. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a nice thing that we start at the bottom. That way we can work our way up towards where we start the mission without having to go out of our way to go find uh, people. Hello. I hate to admit it, but I've seen worse dreadforts. <laughs> I've scheduled a dinner party with the human princess. She speaks quite highly of your chefs. We you have date. multiple. We've got dinner party. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> he actually winds up like that, okay. Oh, we can interrupt that. Nice. Did you remember to pick up some honey? <laughs> Who works for who here? I was just checking. Insectian honey is the best in the world. Okay. Hello again, May Apple. I like what you've done with the place. What do you mean? It seems less, you know, villainy. It does? That's terrible. I'll speak to my minions. Someone's getting dropped into the ocean. <laughs> Could still use a good dusting, though. Ah, oh, you're too kind. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, again, yeah, we need, before, when we move to the next island, we should talk to her again. But just to double check. Yeah, okay. But again, a lot of the comic comes from the dialogue. <laughs> okay, heading over. Let's see, so we have Winter Home, or not Winter Home, Winter Down. Or Sukochi. I recommend we go with the dwarves first. <laughs> of I course. I remember something about the Ogre Kingdom, and that's... You want things. <laughs> Let's see. Next up is the warrior princess Aurelia. Uh, or, or, Ariella. Uh, her kingdom of icy tundra is not uh, will not forgive your trespassing. They say revenge is a dish best served cold. It's, I think they only serve cold dishes. Then I'll just have to melt the resolve with soup made, of, made with an evil spice. <laughs> Grown in the greenhouse of grief and packaged in the processing pan plant of pain. It's the most cruel and flavorful spice that has ever graced a mortal coil. <laughs> it was so unforgivingly malicious that when I wasn't looking it murdered all, our, all of our other spices. Whoa. So it's Sriracha? Nah. <laughs> the counter runs red with paprika. <laughs> no, it's paprika. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> okay, we can't actually go out to go chat with the princess, as it seems. Oh well. Wait, what? Yeah, the door's closed. Oh, Becky, see to it that one of my henchmen restock our spice cabinets. <laughs> you were just fucking around with the spices, weren't you? <laughs> really? <laughs> we're getting a capello from the axe? <laughs> Yakapello. <laughs> the 
Did they just fire a chicken at us? Okay, for a second I thought it was... For a second I thought it was a shield made of dynamite. Yeah. Okay, break the shield and they'll throw the, in, their axe. Okay. <laughs> okay, I was half expecting it to get blocked there, but oh uh, well. <laughs> and hello again, pizza lover. How are you doing? Hello, pizza lover. Let's see what they say. Hello. Uh, yes, uh, gotta be lurking. Okay. Enjoy all the show right. all the same. <laughs> Okay, so the shield guys are mostly just a nuisance, not an actual danger. But, uh, a little danger if you get hit by the axe. Yeah, but, but if you don't break the shields. You. Of course, it slides in with the other one. And somehow I get hurt from him. <laughs> Well, uh, yeah, th this game is called Nefarious, and, well, you can- I think you can get a bit of a feel for it. Okay, what was that noise you made, Crow? Okay, so these guys do give contact damage. Yep. And yeah, this music that you're hearing, I would call it Yakapello because it's a bunch of yaks singing a cappello. Uh, I need to listen to Van Kanto again. But oh, that's. Yeah, but see, yeah, that's uh, heavy metal uh, Yakapello. Uh, a cappella. Damn you, Hill! It... You? <laughs> yeah, I'll let you live. It's. <laughs> it, it, oh, you don't have a shield, so immediately start with. Ow! It's <laughs> split in rain. What did you say about the axes earlier? That wasn't the axes, that was the. <laughs> the enemies in themselves. I guess as long as we don't remove their axe, they are relatively in just a nuisance. But if they start without their axes, then yeah. yeah they, you mean shield? Yep, yep. If they start they without the shield, yeah. Yeah, they throw the throw axes when you they lose the shield. <laughs> what is that noise? Okay, the charge punch doesn't really seem to do much damage to these blocks. But it does do more damage to them. Okay. Something hidden uh, up here? I how good the music in this game is. Ah, there we go. Winter do own national anthem to the land. Okay. So it may sound like gibberish, the lyrics are Princess or Riella's full name. <laughs> At least I got Glee <laughs> Really? Now you can sing along, boss. Not in your lifetime. It. But yeah, some royals do have names. That required like an entire national anthem just to spell them out. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> okay, well, now you're just playing with me. Bye bye. Okay. Moving on. Uh, hello. 
Oh, this is embarrassing. Dr. Nakano. <laughs> Crow, old boy, always good to see a fellow evil genius. Tailward brings you to Winterdown, or as I shall soon be called, uh, it shall uh, soon be called, Mechanopolis. <laughs> I'm expanding my operations, Mechano. What? Hmm. So you hear the kidnapped princess Aurelia too, are you? You may be the big bad of Macro Town, but this kingdom is my turf, Crow. And that's Dr. Macano yeah, to you. I didn't attend villain, uh, villain University for 12 years to be called Mister. <laughs> I take back what I said. It's not good to see you at all. Prepare to be plucked, you purple pave streak. Macro City uh, of Macro Town. <laughs> okay, uh, this guy's like a combination of Robotnik and Bowser. <laughs> or Bowser's clown car. Yeah, I was wondering if this. What this is a reference to? For this one, always be able to stump me. But now if they look in the air and now this guy? Yes, this area might be a reference to Mario? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Careful. We have another alert here, apparently. <laughs> I'll check after we're done here, because I need to be paying a bit of attention. <laughs> Got him on the rebound. Okay, I think going in for punches is a bad idea. Because he seems to have contact damage. It... Well, so I was right about uh, the beam. It may need other villains. Yeah, it happened. Can I destroy those? <laughs> no, I cannot. Okay. Just need to get rid of him. Clean. Uh, oh, hello, Tatum. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the show. Okay, take three. We Immediately for this, huh? Okay, also, how badly do you have things set up if you get electrocuted when you get hit, dudes? You must be sitting on top of an open circuit box or something. Ow. Okay, as we continue listening to Yakapello. <laughs> yeah, this is going to not be funny. You have to, uh, jumped into you, that you one. You want to throw Yakapello team on the ship, don't you? <laughs> Maybe. Double hit! <laughs> okay, the real dangerous attack is the rockets. Since. They don't seem to be able to be destroyed. Yep, nah. No, I just had this mecha, mecha copter washed. I can't conquer a kingdom looking like this. <laughs> but you know what? You can go ahead and take your royal pain for all I care. It's for someone else to deal with her for a change. Hey, no hard feelings. We still down for poker night this weekend. <laughs> but of course, I'll bring the dip and soda. <laughs> All right, I'll bring the chips. <laughs> the evil chips. <laughs> so basically, the back where you have all of the, like, most of the chips are normal, but then you have these really fucking spicy ones in the back, huh? Just in among yeah, them. Nice one. I think when you look at your character, yeah, smoke is coming from it. I think he's overheating it on low health. Yeah, Princess Arella, I presume Pre prepare to be kidnapped. I've seen bigger muscles on the snowflake. 
Go home before you catch cold, pencil man. The mighty crow does not fear the elements. Now open this door. Oh man, this is rich. You really think you can take me, broomstick? I've eluded all your finest warriors up to this point. I'm unstoppable. <laughs> Maybe you can handle them. But there ain't no way you're a match for... <laughs> me. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Get off of me, what are you doing? <laughs> We're getting kidnapped. <laughs> okay, now. <laughs> okay, now we can. <laughs> the crows become a running lemming. <laughs> Time for the gold fashion monster hunting. <laughs> oh, that place, I thought I was the boss. Giddy up, broomstick. <laughs> Is he trying to hit Crow there? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I, I knew I was going to like this game, but this just fully cements it. <laughs> Also, how unstable is the foundation of your castle if they're just going around oh, this much? I don't want to be in the castle. <laughs> Boss, it has become to my attention that you are in need. Stand by. Need of aid. <laughs> oh, we missed one. Oh, well. Um. What the heck is that? That might be a captain, might be a dragon. Bye bye. Oh, okay. it's going to come chase after us, isn't it? Okay, it not, but it might not, but its friends will. Now. Okay. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, we can't hurt them, so we just need to jump them whenever they appear. Thank you. Onward, noble steeds. <laughs> There is nothing noble about me. Get off! <laughs> Finally, my ride is here. <laughs> this is pretty fun. So, do we get to see your ship or what? Wait, you want to come to my ship? Yeah, sure, why not? I could use a change of scenery. Oh, hold it right there, villain. Who is this nutcracker-looking dude? Grr. Oh, great. Now what? I, Gur, Gur, you the righteous, and yet to support you. Wait, you said you're who? Grr, Ryan? I always thought Grr was his first name, and Yon his last. <laughs> was his last. Enough! I, Gurion on the Righteous, will crush you beneath my mighty axe. Your axe is smaller than the princess's. Won't the one of these supposed to be a mix between Mario and Link? Maybe. Either way, we're going to pound him into dust. Oh, he actually deals quite a bit of damage to us. Okay, maybe the axe, axe is mightier than it seems. Oh yeah, this might take a try or two. Gotta lean a... 
<laughs> Just look at him. Oh, now, now he's angry. And here's a trident. Uh. Okay, just resets. Okay, so we can lean to and fro. And then beat this lemming into the ground. <laughs> just look on him like that. Yep, yep. Okay, at least one of the fists needs to be on the ground. Yep. <laughs> yeah, let me get which like reminds me of Mario and the sound he makes. <laughs> Just well. I guess you can say that Morius uh, had a Scandinavian relative. <laughs> yep, well, he's upgraded to a sword now. A big sword. Sit still. Yeah, more link reference. I can't find it. He's probably the only dwarf here that looks Scandinavian. <laughs> Almost to a stereotypical <laughs> level. Okay. <laughs> okay, he's more mighty than he looks, indeed. Oh, now you're just dancing. Yeah, when he glows, you need to lean away. <laughs> he sounds like a bouncy castle. Yep. Yeah, I really, I really should be leaning off to the sides whenever he's starting to throw like that. Yeah, just outside. Yeah. Sit still and be flattened. There we go. <laughs> That's a good little hero. <laughs> Going to be even smaller once we're done here. Yeah, it it takes a bit of time to get us up, to get out of the way as well. So it's a case of trying not to overextend. <laughs> also, I, I get a bit of a feeling that this guy might also be a, in part of reference to the Lost Vikings. Might be all three: Mario, Lost Vikings, Link. Ooh. Almost hit us. <laughs> Ah, damn it. I'm still surprised that Blizzard haven't tried to do a new Lost Viking or Blackthorn. I think it's called another one. I, I think they're way too focused on Warcraft stuff for that, and even that is starting to cost them because the fans are getting sick of their bullshit. Uh, they are working on new IP, actually, uh, even. Uh, they say. Uh, a survival game. They are a bit late with that hype uh, train. There we go. There we... I think we need to play a lot more defensively with this. There, after he throws, he leaves himself wide open for a bit. Is it by the way, is it real that? Did you hear what they actually recently announced? No. They announced five new expansion in these coming. Uh, no, no. So they announced something like it. Also, expansion for next ten years or something. Heroes uh. always lose. Yeah, I think they're massively overestimating how much they can get away with, because yeah. I, at the rate they're going, I doubt they can make it four years. Yeah, and they even have the, one of their better writers or something back. 
Well, my new ship is looking pretty, sp is pretty sweet. I think we'll have a look around. Gonna see what kind of weapons are in the armory. Okay, I think we might have made a mistake with this one. If anyone asks, we kidnapped her. Got it. <laughs> My kingdom has been sending aid to dwarven people, uh, to dwarven people for some time now. So, do you want a medal? Jeez, I thought you just thought you'd like to know. Jerk. <laughs> I'm sending the minions on a hot cocoa run. Want anything? A big steaming cup of my dignity back. <laughs> Out of stock. <laughs> can I put it in a back order? If you can wait four to six weeks for shipping and processing. <laughs> okay, this metaphor is getting depressing. Oh. Uh, let's see, any new... Th anything new? Nope. Yeah, nothing new with any of these. Okay. You anything new? The wolves can be quite brutish. I'm a bit up. Uh, yeah, I'm a bit on the fence about Aurelia. <laughs> she burped a while ago in my presence. I nearly fainted. Get off your high horse or your oh, high hornet. Hmm? This game is longer than what I think. So I think we okay. will revisit it soon again. Okay. Nice armory you got going here. You build all this crap yourself? Aside from really being a ruthless tyrant, I'm quite mechanically gifted. I might have it. It's a commission a war machine or two from, <laughs> from you before this is all done. <laughs> Do I look like some kind of freelance hack? Just saying. Keeping in mind. Okay, I think these two might like each other better. <laughs> After a few decades. Let's see, pizza. These level designs, uh, uh, all this electronic and stuff, reminds me of the levels from Sonic. It, it has some similarities to that. Okay, nothing yes. new there. A lot of homage to many old uh, games with the uh, heroes, princesses, special bosses, and all that. Yeah. So Let's get that second one. like a lullet to those games. Just you're playing for the villain side instead. Yeah. Having only one mechanical arm seems rather inefficient. You should have all your limbs mechanized. Dragons too. We can surely make something more robust. And while we're in there, mechanical brains are more efficient than biological ones. We should just make a robot. No thanks. And as far as I know, human brain is much more than a computer since... Well, if you compare the terabyte size to a computer and a human brain, human brain outperforms in that regard. <laughs> The pizza lover. I just realized, why is everything so pink? I think it's supposed to be purple, but I think it's... <laughs> it turned to pink in the wash. Okay, why does it reset us here? Okay, time for the Ogre Kingdom. Sukochi. Wait, I'm for... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do get upgrades. <laughs> Citizens are overheating across the board. This won't, <clears throat> this won't be easy. Princess Thepi, uh, Thepra is the biggest, meanest princess in the world. She is a tyrant, practically a villain, a villain in our own right. I have no idea what protocol is for villain pin the princesses. We will have to play this one by ear. Yes, okay. I got the second health upgrade, so we'll have to see if we need to redo this or redo other ones for uh, to get other upgrades. Oh. Okay, I got one of them. 
Uh, more like two, but still. Okay, liking the music. Hello there. You look more like an Oni than an Ogre. Then again, I think the difference tends to be small. Well, okay, no contact damage. Many times when people translate Oni, it becomes either demon or ogre. So there's basically two types. Yeah. Oni the... as the ogre, and Oni as demon later when uh, Christianity came. Okay. At least I think that's how it is. Let's see. I think to get there, we need to do a grenade jump or something. Because we can't make that jump. Hmm. I think I remember seeing an anime where they ask uh, in Japanese with sub uh, subtitle uh, for clarification. The, and like, do you mean Oni is from the mountains or Oni is from hell? And then uh, clarify that meant like um, your mountain or Oni. Okay, and um, I think Oni is also just the, the multiple. Yeah, but yeah, it, it, when you do try to translate it to English and also take a account that it has variations. Mm. And those are Tengu. Yep. <laughs> or at least they have Tango mats. Oh, hello there. I don't know what those are supposed to be. Mm. Capt? I've been keeping my manly eye on you, villain. I'm Captain Man. <laughs> Super... Uh, even though you have a beautifully wonderful secretary, I must stop you in now. Because if I do, she'll be out of work. And then I can ask her for a date. Really? Are you talking about Becky? Maybe. Say hello to my, to my little gauntlet. Do it. Okay, those don't mess around. Give me that. <laughs> the heck is the <laughs> that sign painting? <laughs> okay. Wait, those are coins. Let's just. And oh, there she is. A poster. That must be her, yeah. Charming. Yes. Can we just blow those up with grenades? No, they don't blow up on. You know, contact with those, I think. But we can check out the next pair. Thank you. <laughs> it's that girly scream of his when he gets hit there every now and then. I think he's trying to sound like a panicking crow. <laughs> okay, those shots go through these. Oh, I see. We're supposed to use that thing as cover. Okay, I thought it was moving up with me. We'll never defeat the Gondola of Man. Oh, come on. That should have hit him. There we go. Yep. Bad idea. <laughs> okay. Yep. Did something just jump into the abyss? Okay, now let's wait for it to come back. There. Mm. There we go. Just want to get rid of that thing before trying to move on. Just then we have to dodge only that. I have to say that does look intimidating on that pic. Or painting poster. Painting poster? It's the stare, ain't it? Yeah, just an absolute out death stare. 
But yeah, that, that is just one of the Tengu Nobi <laughs> jumping to their death. <laughs> okay. Nobi? Yeah, techno, uh, Tengu Shinobi. Okay, that makes a bit more sense. I was wondering, Tengu Nobi? What the heck is that? <laughs> I bent in my brain. <laughs> Hmm. It's quite the eye movement in those things. It... There we go, got him. Got our cash back. Ow. Damn it. Oh, come on. Come on. Hell. Okay, only reason I died there was because I bumped the underside of the platform. Okay, good thing those things can't actually turn around or anything like that. Oh, oh great, there's more behind there. Wait, was there? Okay, those flying masks are really annoying. I say, no wonder. Can we return to the ship and we get the upgrades? Yeah, we don't have enough money for any upgrades. True, but still, I wonder if it's still a option. Good, not jumping after that. <clears throat> So far, I could see us if we do one level just for the extra coin, for I feel like we are under-equipped for some reason here. Nah, it's not under-equipped, it's just that these stupid things get getting in my way. And what I mean is, I feel like they, we may need another weapon against the damn mask. Yeah, the missiles may, would be, it may be useful, but... The missiles or the machine gun thing. There. There okay, we go. Last time there was one of those cannons on this one here. Why not now? Really? That platform goes below the kill line? Okay, that was just stupid. There we go, got rid of them. <laughs> yeah, flying enemies and platforming never go well together. I was saying, really? The order doesn't really can go well, but. usually don't. Especially in these kind of situations where you have to jump a lot and they shoot. There we go. Ooh, get out of the way. Oh, there we there go. We go. You totally defeated the Gondol of Man. Wait, wait, time out. I don't want to fight you. I am this kingdom's designated hero, but... I just don't believe you can actually kidnap Princess Tefia, uh, Tefra. No offense, she's freaking scary strong. That being said, can you, uh... Do me a solid. If you do, I'll open this door for you. Promise. Though you doubt the mighty uh, crow, I do need this door opened. Awesome, we have an agreement. No, what we have is a dark pact. 
Whatever. Deliver this letter to your white-haired goddess of a secretary. <laughs> Are you creeping on Becky again? Just do it, okay? Fine, I will consider it. That's all I'm asking. Now, if you'll excuse me, time to make my signature exit. Captain... <laughs> Captain Caveman. Uh. You pick up the letter, it's sealed with a heart-shaped wax stamp. It smells of Le Paragon, a popular hero cologne. <laughs> Come on. This is a love letter, I'm going to be ill. Uh, oh god. You big boy. Oh, oh. oh the huge manatee. If you defeat 100 with grenades, really? Okay. Oh, I get it now. Yeah, the humanity, the, the manatee. It's a, it's a youthful pun of another phrase. Yep. Give me that. Oh, humanity. But it's a manatee instead. And yeah, they, they get just, crushed. They just switch them around like... I would not be surprised if someone misheard that and got the well, huge manity. And bloody... Oh, he does... The... Okay, now he stopped. Okay, apparently these are solid enough. Oh, oh no, they're, they're up in the freaking rafters. Okay, yeah, nope. Are we taking that? Oh, no, we missed one. It's just probably going to vanish, yep, before we can grab it. Okay, now don't you go down. I said don't. <laughs> Here we go again. Oh, uh, well. We should have enough now for a few upgrades at least. <clears throat> yeah, I hope we can grab those on the way back. Yoink. Yep. Okay, and I'm guessing okay. we're just outside the boss fight, which is going to be with the bloody princess herself, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I is something about section Discord just not like. <laughs> well, every time you went up and down that, he started to lag. This fine. Be gone, foolish human. A pleasure to meet you, Princess Tefra. Uh, <laughs> you there? <laughs> Squeaky toys. Who the heck are you? Malachite? What is the meaning of this? Who are you? Crow. I'm Crow. To whom do I have to the pleasure of terrorizing? <laughs> I am Prince Malachite, Lord of Flame. Well, you know, I normally kidnap princesses, but I'm equal opportunity bad guy. Plus, you look way easier to kidnap than your sister. So long as you're royalty. <laughs> Yoink! Oh, we get... <laughs> we get flame grenades now, huh? Wait. Can we stand on those? Yes, we can. <laughs> okay. Hey, the body. <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, oh, it can. You do. You need to be careful. You see now. There. Okay. You. Nope. Yeah, we can make our own platforms, but they will crumble away quite quickly. Yeah, and you can also end up you doing making your own trap with them against yourself. Yeah. 
Okay, there has to be something down here. Oh, yep. Wow, really? You're just gonna take our stuff? I'm a bad guy. It's kind of what I do. It's Scrooge. Gain 10,000. Rude. <laughs> What's that smell? I know that smell. Deer <laughs> repellent. We have to put the stuff down or, it, or this place starts crawling with them. <laughs> of course, I should have known. We sprayed up stuff in the vents on the sovereign. <laughs> really? Uh. Okay, this game just... Okay, is there something this way? Doesn't is, look like it. Is there a alien humor, I guess you could say? <laughs> or rather, yeah. the humor that hits just right for you? <laughs> uh, perhaps. Get out of the way, big nose. Okay. I, I was honestly expecting that we'd have a boss fight with the freaking princess. Mm, here we go. I'm guessing there's a crowd. Oh, there's at least that up there. There we go. That'll be worth an upgrade. Okay. There. Okay, another cannon. Yeah, their, their eye focuses before they fire. Or at least it see that's what it seems like to me. You know, I know a guy. Great discount on giant spy corpse of death. <laughs> oh yeah, because we're running short of those. I'm just saying. <laughs> okay, just squeeze on through there. They could probably start their own store on these, and hello, I wasn't even looking for this. Song of Sukochi to your boot box. Um, uh, Fuji Katamaru means after the rain, earth hardens. Uh, Nerds. <laughs> okay, that passed a bit too quick for me to read. There we go. Oh, crown. Okay, did get hurt there, but uh, well. Uh, uh, okay, I was half expecting Ooh. that to be a death trap. Same. Yeah, their their eye focuses forwards, then they fire. Okay. Gotta be closing in on the boss fights. Hmm. Okay. Yep. <laughs> really? The boss didn't release the Lord of Fire. Who are these guys? They look weird. <laughs> Heroes. <laughs> they want to slay me, Crow. They must have been with the Prince of Hotness. <laughs> you guys can't beat him. I'm kidnapping him. 
I like the new look, boss. What, what happened? <laughs> it's how we deal with heroes here. Just roll with it. <laughs> really? I forgot that this part. We, see, we got... <laughs> here are your blows. Heal. Okay, yep. Yeah. Gotta get rid of the healer. And then we've got the mage. Okay, we've got Crush, Fallon, and Wustin. Okay. Okay, that's our AoE. <clears throat> Just gotta make sure that the healer can't heal faster than we can deal damage. Yeah, I think they can only heal one at a time, so... Okay. Yeah, if we just do the grenade launch a few more times, we should just beat them down from sheer numbers. That's just all you do, huh, melee? Okay. A few more of these, and at least one of them should be down. Because if we uh, if we just try to heal up or beat down the healer, I think she will out heal us or something. Actually, we probably deal more damage than she can heal. Otherwise, it'd be an infinite loop. Yeah, but she can only heal one at a time, so. And she pr uh, prioritizes herself, it seems. Okay, this is going to take out Crush. No, oh, actually the other one this time. Okay. This should be an instant kill. No, not an instant, but yeah, there we go. We've it's won. Based. <laughs> Oh, Bye -bye. she looks tired. And of course, it, a winner is me. Okay, of course, the Japanese kingdom plays like a JRPG. <laughs> That's one ugly princess. Oh, you cheeky bird. I'm Prince Malice. Malachite. Charmed. I see Captain Man has not exaggerated your beauty by one bit. Is that a lounge I see? I hope you won't be offended if I make myself at home. <laughs> Boss, we have a critical situation. The energy demands on the Sovereign have been excessively high. She's a good ship, but considering we just put her through two extreme opposing climates... <laughs> Not to mention our medical expenses are racking up as your minions engage more resistance than we ever have in the past. I've been crunching the numbers with all of this new data. Our loot crate reserve will be bled dry long before we achieve your goals. We need some quick gold to stay on schedule. Fortunately, we have several rich captives on board. Perhaps now may be the time to attempt diplomacy? Let's see. Speak with the princesses and prince about solving your financial woes. <laughs> really? Hey, so let's say just hypothetical, uh, hypothetical like that I needed a small loan of a million lucre. Personal policy I don't lend money to friends. We are not friends. We were playing tennis just last weekend, did we? <laughs> uh, Mario Tennis. I'll do your last right the line, Judge. <laughs> that ball was in bounds and you know it. He's whatever, I'll ask someone else. Yeah, this game is just a love letter. Yeah. 
Someone will be willing to help us out. Just keep asking. Mm, is it I'm fifty feet about money on friends? Like I think the motive is on which friend you lend it to. Yeah. <clears throat> Labor like you, you must have money to spare, right? Sorry about your cash trubs, my dudes, but my sister has me on a strict budget. You spend one wild night on the town and you lose access to the royal vault. I was boiling mad, but what can you do? Ah. <laughs> okay. Can someone, uh, share the honey? Are you seriously asking me for money? Just a little bit, just to get us through the weekend, really. Well, you were asking the wrong princess. My kingdom's coffers are not faring well. The honey market has crashed. Though if I had a submarine, things would be different. Why? I have a submarine. You do? Yeah, the Death Pod is an all-terrain vehicle. I made it to Room Air or Sea. There's just one problem. What's that? I hate you. I get it a lot, but do you hate me enough to see your empire go broke? Got her there. Sunken treasure in the heartless abyss, a treacherous deep full of monsters and giant urchin. You have the undersea crafts, I have the coordinates of the treasure. Should be enough there to replenish our coffers, get your ship back in order, and net a little spending lucre for us both. 70 30 splits. 50 50. Deal, but only because I'm desperate. As a mine. However, if you double cross me, <laughs> I'll rogue at my words. Besides, double crosses are only fun when you are unexpected. <laughs> Swindling you out of your cut wouldn't be a very impressive feat of villainy. <laughs> All right, we, we forgot to speak with the dwarf. Let's see. Can does he still have something new to say? That maybe. <clears throat> I was off, I was half expecting her to be one to, <laughs> to pay. Okay. Going out in the ocean in that death trap? Good luck. Okay, I think we missed that. Yeah. Oh uh, well. <laughs> uh. Let's see, let's grab that. Um Hmm. Let's save up a bit. Then we can get one of the other uh, the, one of the uh, other grenade types. <clears throat> I've agreed to help you already. Let's get a move on. All right, that's something to understand. Mm, yeah. No, uh, no. It looks like they may have new in the uh, topic. Get your trubs sorted out? Glad to hear it. The Heartless Abyss doesn't sound like a place for someone like me. Now, if it was the heartfelt <laughs> weld, we'd be talking. What is a weld? Look it up. I know it's it's a Dutch word for field, but I don't know if it would mean the same in English. <laughs> a podia needed money? Oh, it's cute you two are teaming up. <laughs> okay, we've got some 20 more minutes, so I think we could, should be able to do another level. Maybe we talk to... Uh... Hey, never mind. Hmm? All right, we didn't talk to Becky. Let's see what she has to say on this. You convinced Princess Aperdia to help? Good job, boss. <laughs> you ever find out about? Uh, yeah, you ever find out about the thorax? <laughs> it's a work in progress. 
I'm at the edge of my seat. I think she's being sarcastic there. Okay, here we go then. Okay, I'm almost ready. Yep, oh, that's her. You sure? With certainty, I shall make the most of this kidnapping. <laughs> Adventure and treasure hunting. Let's go. <laughs> okay, an entire level with her on our shoulder, and of course I miss every oh, single one. Every single one? You start the first level like that, and the last level of the stream you've <laughs> for love of all captain they switch it out with an anchor okay this art style is a reference to something but i'm blanking on what exactly at the moment i remember the <laughs> other section this did not really look like this <clears throat> let's see I'm not worried for, uh, for this. So why all the villainy? <laughs> I come from a long line of air pirates. This is what I'm good at. So would you say you're good at being bad? Stop, stop it. Are you really going to share this treasure with me? Yeah, I've accidentally skipped some. Villainy 101, save the double cross for the final act. Treasury is too low stakes. I wouldn't waste a good go a double cross on that. Your surprising preoccupation with tropes is working in my favor. <laughs> oh, princess, I'm dangerously trope savvy. <laughs> no, my <not> force. <clears throat> there we go. Get some stubborn. Ow. Okay, those are not for touching. Some stubborn uh, seaweeds. Okay, everything Urchin. pink is to be avoided. Yep, including that. No, no, come on, you're just getting me stuck underneath it. <laughs> That's not fair. <clears throat> I realize, where's the money come to? It's the chest, by the way. What? A thorax, you asked before. Well, it's the, it's the breastplate. Uh, uh, thanks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How does it feel to know that, Hibian? Uh, not too surprising, Everything out, considering everything else. Okay, here the anchor is going to be an, well, an anchor to us. <clears throat> I'm trying to get through those. And I guess that also explain her reaction earlier when they asked about it. Yeah. Oh, but Crow asked about it, not Hillian. <laughs> so I will not be surprised. He... Actually, no, I think he... He... you would probably be more careful about asking such a question. Yeah. <clears throat> and you cough right after that. Now you <laughs> made me doubt you! <laughs> Oh, come on, game. Yep, still count it, okay. <clears throat> okay. Moving on. Hey, you know you're moving yeah. <laughs> uh, Super Mario 64 wants its uh, eels back. Ow. Where's the money counter? Probably on board the little thing. <clears throat> okay. Can't hurt these things. Can't really get much momentum going with this anyways. Okay, that still sounded like an impact, but it didn't do anything against it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Just roly poly on through. <laughs> okay. Is this oddly peaceful like this? Despite all the death and danger? Yeah, this feels weird. Let's not get dragged back by those things. <clears throat> Yeah, pizza lover, love the calming music. The, yeah, dude, just the music walls just of is death. good. <clears throat> is that what you were saying there, Captain? Yeah, just walls of pink death here. Uh, oh, there you go. I was saying, where did the music go? <clears throat> okay. What's with all of that? Uh, this is for Pizza Lover. You, you know what they say, it's always the silence right before the storm or however that saying goes. The, yeah. yeah the calm before the storm. I'm, I mean, I'm sure we should even expect a boss fight here. Yep. That probably is this one. Ow, still got me there. <clears throat> oh, I fucked up right, right, right. Each princess we have our extra mission like this. Okay. <clears throat> the <clears throat> other ones will give you something like this as well. Okay. Probably not exactly like this one, but... A little side stunt. Yeah. Let's see, pizza, you sure <laughs> they're just eels? Uh, no, I get the feeling eels, perhaps? I get the feeling we're going to run into some sort of leviathan. Okay, some buried ship here. I don't think that's just ship. And there were parts of it and an anchor. Oop. Oh, th those pillars look more like... Uh... Oh, it was Atlanta, that... Uh... Either Jumbo Squid... No, wrong. No, Jumbo Squid had, uh, has that head. Yeah. Can we just stop here for a moment? For a mere 20 seconds, I simply adore this view. Let's see, one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, six. Yep. I've never fe felt quite so alone. Sometimes that can be a nice feeling. Getting away from it all, seeing new places. When I'm aboard your ship or in my own palace, I'm a prisoner, it seems. Shackled by responsibility. I do love my people, and I would certainly never walk away from my kingdom. But I do crave the occasional adventure. Hm. I apologize for rambling. Let's proceed. Thank you for indulging me. Okay, showing some uh, actual depth. I was hoping I was really only stopping there to see if there was an achievement for it. I did tell you it's it, it, hilarious, but also uh, warming. <laughs> I did warn you about that. Yeah. Okay, back to this pink Wait. death. Warning about a bit heartwarming. Is that something really should have warned you about? Maybe, <laughs> if someone is dead of heart. Hmm. Okay. Moving on along. Uh, let's see here. From Pizza Lover. That looks like <laughs> sentient turds. I think it means the... <laughs> I think we're going to get chased. Uh, hello there. 
And back on a ship of sorts. Uh, back with the ship. ship? I thought those were Hello. pillars. <laughs> we found it by the six legs of Ikothor. We found it. You may uh, you have done the Insectia Kingdom of North you know, the noteworthy service, Mr. Crow. Through the cavernous depths around the jaws of beast and over the colossal urchins. We have conquered the heartless depths. A beast. Yep, a beast. Yep. I hate to admit it, but our little adventure together has been rather fun. <laughs> I think if you weren't a villain, I wouldn't mind being friends. <laughs> well, hey, just because I'm blind to only usurping every monarch on the planet. <laughs> It doesn't mean we can't occasionally go out treasure hunting. It kind of does, actually. Ah, bolts. <laughs> well, then I'll just have to console myself with a giant pile of money. <laughs> okay, I was only expecting some fight at the end there. Uh, oh, what? You didn't shoot an expecter? You still have time. <laughs> okay. There is probably more spent on talking. Wonderful. Even after a podius uh, uh, cut, we have plenty to fuel our war machine. However, I must inform you, your minions have un uh, uh, uncovered some frightening intel in your absence. That's what I paid them for. It seems you are not the only villain on the block who knows about the power of the monarchy. Dr. Cackle has come to the same conclusion as you, but is approaching it from a different angle. Namely, he is collecting raw magical energy and compressing it into concentrated forms. He seeks to create a device much like the Doom Howitzer, except instead of kidnapping royalty, he is attempting to mass produce artificial princesses. Fortunately, as far as I can tell, his efforts have only produced a single entity. Delightfully evil, but this is a problem for us in the long run. <laughs> or an opportunity. If we snag his prototype, I will have the lost princess I need. A clever plot. I will input the coordinates for Adaptco headquarters. <laughs> Be wary, I used to work the front desk there. They put on a smiling front, but the company is every bit as evil as we are. Okay. Move the map order. I saved it earlier. In the first level, uh, in the tutorial level. <laughs> Let's see. I didn't know you were going on an underwater adventure. <laughs> that sounds like it was a lot of fun. Mac and I used to go on adventures like that. But whatever, I've moved on. Anything the other? One of your minion captains is out sick this week. I've been passing around to get well soon card for everyone to sign. Ugh. Do not worry, I've already forged your signature. Thank you. Do not worry about it. It's not the first time I've had have done that. What? Hmm? <laughs> Let's see, these two are starting to feel like Bowser and Peach, yeah. <laughs> Let's see, Malachite. Glad you got everything sorted out. It's pretty embarrassing though, borrowing money from our ca from your captors. You're kind of a weird dude, but I can dig it. <laughs> Okay, let, let's have a chat with the others, and then we'll call it. Well, we'll go over look for some of the raids. That is. I'm shocked you've stayed true to your words. My kingdom was quite surprised to suddenly get a delivery to the Royal Vault. You are a surprising fellow, Mr. Crow. <laughs> and uh, what does he have to say? <laughs> Ah, I can't believe you suckered Princess Bug Eyes into treasure hunting. A dwarf wouldn't be caught dead out in the ocean. 
No, if you were out on the ocean, you would probably be dead. <laughs> Anything new to say? That's one of your oldest creations, I have to say. You've been doing a sound job. <laughs> you can't be bothered to build me a set of legs. But sound job all around. <laughs> Splendid. Okay, we might need to keep an eye on our legs whilst we upgrade, or he might run off with them. Yeah, we should probably get some more arm upgrades since we can equip two uh, arm uh, things. Yeah. Let's see. Shall we do the rocket punch? Let's. Okay, there we go. And I'm thinking we might go for the missile or just the assault rifle for our upgrade here. Okay. Ooh. Now. Let's see. There's not really a manual pause key, it see or manual save key, it seems. Oh, so there is an X6 stage. Alright. Hmm. Okay, the, it, okay, it isn't really a ranged attack, but it does extend our attack range. That is nice. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Pizza. Well done, I think I'll go. I'm starting to feel quite the tired. Uh, fun setting. I hope to see you soon. Remember to stay hydrated and goodbye, ladies and gentlemen, whatever you identify as. Okay, see ya, <laughs> see ya, pizza. Be safe, uh, pizza. Okay. Oh, hello. Crow, we need to talk. Make it snappy. I know we've been having a good time and all. But this is all going too far. I want to go home. Well, you can't. I'm the villain. I've abducted you. Is this what you really want? Mac isn't here to stop you anymore. You might actually succeed this time. Doesn't that terrify you? I'm finally winning for once. I can't stop now. You're making a huge mistake. I don't doubt you can make it. The way you're going about this, the things you're going to have to sacrifice. Where you're headed, you can't take anyone with you. Enough, minions. Seize Princess May Apple and throw her into the brig. I don't need her or anyone. Yes, sir. Act in your own best interest, Crow. Call this off. You don't need to change the world like this. You can do it with us. Take her away. Okay. Very Stockholm Syndrome vibes. Uh... Not so much. But I think I can see at least one part that will play into an ending, then. <clears throat> okay. I get the feeling that we'll probably be able to finish this game next week, but still, just a, an absolute <laughs> blast. No! <laughs> <laughs> okay, someone thinks no, then. <laughs> Probably two or three more streams, more like it. Okay, we'll have to see then. But for now... <laughs> for now, let's head on over here. And go look for someone to raid again. We raided Zinovea earlier, so she's off the list. Uh, let's see. Close that off. And change over the screen share. To the browser there okay let's have a look dr misunderstood is still playing yakuza like a dragon purple target has gone online with star citizen then we have swabe who is playing retro games uh let's see jagged alliance 2 or okay <laughs> he just quit okay let me just refresh to make sure that everyone here is actually online okay there we go uh, Black Shadow is playing Control. Codename Ferret is playing Foxhole. Chubbis the Moonseal is online with Dark Souls 2. 
Lazarus is playing Super Mario Wonder. Smoops on the Nonsense is playing Stellaris. Horatio the Dwarf, Horatius the Dwarf has moved on to The Lord of the Rings Return to Moria, which I'm still interested in. I just don't want to give Epic any of my money on that. Because, let's be honest, the Epic Store is just still inferior to Steam on anything <clears throat> anything other than the, the amount that they pay out to the uh, developers and such. Don't let's forget, the all are also, in many cases, almost tone deaf. Like, whenever Steam does something that everyone prays for what I'm doing, that is actually good and outright morally good to do, they end up going, doing the opposite and make it, try to make it sound good. And just people just look and go, No, that's horrible. Yeah, and, and from what I've heard, even though it's been running for five years now, it hasn't made a cent of profit. So I wouldn't be half exp yeah, I wouldn't be half uh, surprised if they just end it one day because it's they're just losing money on it. Yeah, like the other company. I don't know if it's the main company. Like the, this Giugi, as an example, and other console fronts, but. They, they do it more fair. They don't. They're not directly competing with each other. Uh, yeah, they, they do. <laughs> there is a bunch of games that you can get on both platforms, but they aren't actively trying to hurt each other. Yeah, the only one that's actively tries to compete with Steam and the others thinks they are doing well is Epic Store. They are failing horribly at it. Yeah, you could say they are headed for an epic fail. Yeah. Anyways, moving on, we have WBPL who is streaming MechWarrior Online. Then we have Touch Scaly Tail with Lords of the Fallen. Halloween is playing Indigo Prophecy. And that's about it in our typical range. Or should we go look for someone else? I'm taking a quick peek through the recommended. Uh, someone playing Clock Tower 3. Hmm. Their own, uh, their own risk for that. <clears throat> okay. Anyone you want to suggest, or shall I pick? Yeah, I feel a bit stumped here. Eh, uh, let's go say hi to Lazarus. Yeah, it's been okay. a while. Copy the name. Head to our place, slash raid and paste. But before we start, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Thank you, Pizza Lover. Thank you, Tatum. And thank you, as always, Rakir. You're welcome, as always, my friend. And thank you all for joining. And I see Sensei is lurking as usual. Welcome back again. <laughs> okay. And yeah. Let's see, tomorrow we have Showcase Sunday. I have a decent amount of game, yeah, I have a decent collection of games set up for that. And I think by next week, we should be, you know, by next weekend, we should be done with the Space Marines, uh, fact, Space Marines camp version of the campaign of Dawn of War 2 Retribution, so we can start on the other factions there as a side thing. <clears throat> But yeah, for now, uh, Showcase Sunday tomorrow, maybe LA Noir. If not, we'll do a chill stream. I'm thinking Planet Zoo or Jurassic uh, World Evolution 2. Hmm. But yeah. yeah. Yeah, I guess we'll see. But I'm still debating on the Planet Zoo part. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking if it had dinosaurs, it jumped to your first spot since it's uh, younger, I believe, than... Or I think it's more developed than uh, Jurassic World 2. Yeah, okay, I, 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 like, I like animals, especially... Well, actually, I like current and ancient and future animals. <laughs> okay, we'll just have to see. Maybe we'll flip a coin. Uh... We'll just see. <clears throat> For now, though, let's start up that raids. There we go. No shields. And, uh, yeah. Thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe, everyone, and watch out for undead seagulls. <laughs> and, uh, crow.
Enhydien. 